Beginning to look at things with a critical eye at first may seem difficult because you have to approach it in a very kind of step-by-step -step process. But over time, my hope is that when you begin to get practice in doing this with the articles and essays in our class, with the visual ads and commercials that we've been looking at, and the more practice, the easier it will become for you to look at something immediately and say, oh, that's what it is, that's what's happening, and it's just a matter of practice, right? Because this type of practice is going to help you when you go out and you interview, right? And you think about, okay, I'm going to do a mock interview. Now, I don't know how many of you have ever filmed yourself in a mock interview before, but I would highly encourage you to do so because you get to really see what your strengths are, what your weaknesses are, right? And it'll begin to help you critically look at yourself and evaluate yourself in order so you can become a stronger arguer for yourself, right? And it all comes down to being able to look at something critically. And so this chapter is going to give you some of those tool sets that not only can you apply to a text, but you'll be able to apply to different aspects of your life in order so you can, like the whole goal of this week is, to present yourself to a potential employer in a strong and effective manner. So hopefully you get as much out of this chapter as I hope you do. And if you have any questions along the way, please feel free to drop in during my office hours and I'm more than happy to help you.